So Sam, um, just a couple of minutes ago, we were discussing about the Ford uh, Mustang Mach-E and, and how we, we think the brand actually fits, um, fits the concept. And, and you just had a conversation with a lady at Ford. So tell us about it. Yeah, so um, I was a little bit concerned that they were potentially diluting the Mustang brand by using it on something that was not a, a true Mustang. But she made a compelling argument, which is that Mustang sales are reducing. That's a segment that's uh, becoming more and more of a niche. Um, with the Camaro last year, they had, are they going to make it? Are they not going to make it? So um, the future of those kind of pony cars and muscle cars is uncertain. You know, they've got that bad gas guzzling image. So they thought, well, now is the right time to, to give the heritage of Mustang a chance to survive into the future okay. and to try and take some of the spirit of the Mustang, which is about performance, it's about drive, it's about excitement, um, into a more modern electric vehicle package. So I think that, that's a fair argument. I think it's a good one. That, that does indeed sound very intriguing and, and I'm actually looking forward to see whether performance wise the car will, will be able to, to bring a bit of that Mustang heritage yes. into, into the electric um, driving. Um, because we all know that the acceleration with electric vehicles is impressive, so maybe that's that's the angle. Yes. How to how to find the connection to to the Mustang brand? Yeah, it's going to be exciting. So the show at uh, in Las Vegas, the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, is also a lot about the future of retail and the future yeah, of um, exactly. of dealership. And we see in the background one of the latest editions, I would say, in the. Yeah, in, in that uh, field of, of business, and it's Amazon. Um, and you see in the background also the future of automotive retailing. We've seen examples from Honda yesterday, um, who are partnering with Moda, I believe. And um, yeah, the future of automotive retail is definitely going to be online. And Amazon has a prime spot uh, in the middle of the show and is really making a big fuss out of it. So now we're here at the FCA booth at the CES in, in Las Vegas and I was just wondering maybe this is the perfect combination for all those petrol heads and car guys who still are interested into, into technology but cannot fully let go of their, of their beloved off-road um, off cars. So maybe they, they can get in there, they have the experience of an off-road ride but still playing games, so maybe that's the perfect combination.